All right, guys, I want to give you a little update on the HDMR gun and the progress I'm making towards the batch of 50 that I plan on selling on my website. Um, so here are the first aluminum samples uh, from the vendor. Now, the reason I'm doing this video is this piece looks a little different than this. So let me explain it. I'm talking about this area right here. Okay, so you can see here on the 3D printed part, it's nicely blended and all that good stuff. Well, you can model anything you want and print it, but then actually manufacturing it is a whole nother story, right? And I knew this area would be challenging because you're going from a round to like an oval, okay? So the way they did this um, is obviously they have it set up like this and like this, like that, and then the last pass, I guess, is like this, okay? So they come in here like this, and mill and this was done on a three axis machine okay so at the end of the day this is somewhat of a functional part or feature and then again it's cosmetic as well okay so let me explain what this does first we have to house the nozzle right but secondly it acts as like a grip point or a ledge for your hand to fit so first you can hold the gun like this okay and actually your finger fits really nice here in this relief. So that's, that's one option. Another option is like this. So you have a little bit of a, a ledge here to hold your hand, right? You can go any which way like that, or you can even hold it like this, okay? And when you have your finger like that, it's just comfortable, okay? So those are all the ways you can hold it, and it seems to work, okay? There's no sharp edges here or anything, um, so that all looks good. Um, the only change that he's going to do is probably... Uh, radius this a little more okay and then sink this fitting into the body about a thread and a half see how it's sticking out a little bit um, so that's super easy stuff okay um, I ordered nozzles I have a whole bunch of them I'll show you uh, this part and this part is on order they're making the full batch and it should be available first week of February um, I'm gonna have to meet with the anodizer now to choose a color and go over the anodizing process um, and then we're good to go it, it looks like I'm targeting mid-February I'll be able to ship these okay so came out super nice yeah I'm really happy with it so that's that's the body that's exciting um, no need to test it at this point because these parts are still FDM um, again those videos will be coming um, but yeah, this is just an update on the body. So here's the 3D printed part, and here's the actual. It's a little different here, but no big deal, right? So I have ordered like 100 nozzles um, because I know some people are going to buy replacements, which I need to set up on my website. And these, I can order these and get these in just a few days, so I'm not worried about this. But anyway, I ordered a whole bunch of them. There's a couple boxes back here, so we got a ton of, ton of nozzles. Okay, as far as anodizing is concerned, the colors available are red, gold, green, blue, and black. Um, gold is out of the question. I don't really like gold. Red, not too fond of that either. So it's either green, blue, and black, okay? Um, here's the green. I'm leaning towards the green, okay, guys? I mean, that's the color in my branding. Um, it's one of my favorite colors. Um, the blue is nice as well. Black's pretty cool too, but I think I'm leaning towards green guys okay so uh, I'm gonna drop off a sample at this anodizer he's gonna anodize it and then I'll report back and see how it looks all right guys also I have set up shipping for uh, the UK Belgium Norway Denmark Australia Canada and the Netherlands okay so those are people that have reached out to me saying hey this is where I live can you calculate the shipping and all that good stuff so I have done that pre-order link is uh, in the video description or up here and the thing with pre-ordering is your credit card doesn't get charged and I do not plan on um, taking the charges or charging you until I release the final product video and the performance so you can see and then you can even uh, make your decision then back out of it or whatever okay so that's how that all works all right pre-order links in the video description if your country hasn't been mentioned just email me and I'll get a shipping estimate and I'll set it all up so that way you can pre-order Okay, so that's it for this video. Uh, stay tuned. I'll give you an update in a week or two when I should have more info 
for you. Thank you.